Welcome to the Network Engineering Video Blog. I am your host, Michael Crane. In today's very short video, we're going to look at the updates I made to our quote unquote best SIP test bed. So let's get started. Okay, so here's the, uh, the new test bed. I added um, a third phone to the test bed. I also uh, re IP'd uh, the phones. I, I don't remember what the other ones were, but this one's dot 44, dot 45, and 46. I also named the phones, phone A, phone B, phone C. Let's go ahead and fire this guy up. So yeah, so all the, um, all the phones are running uh, using power over ethernet from the SMC switch. So as soon as the switch boots up, it'll start booting the phones up. And the reason why I named the phones phone A, B, and C, it's kind of a shortcut when you're doing uh, SIP call testing. So the, the terminology, if you're in the telecom world for uh, having one phone call another is you know, A calls B, or you can have A calls B and transfers to C, or you can have A calls B, B puts A on hold, and you kind of get the idea. All right, looks like they're booted up. Excellent. So none of the phones are registered to a, um, a proxy or or back-to-back -back user agent, which would be the uh, like a PBX or anything. So, and I also provisioned all the lines. You can see so it shows this is line one extensions one thousand one two three and four for these four lines up here. This is five through eight. And that's uh, 9 through 10, 11, 12. All right, that's it for this video. I know it's really short, but I wanted to make the test bed changes with the updates to our test bed drawing easy to find and not really buried in a, in a longer video. So I hope you like it. If you do, give it a big thumbs up, that helps. And hit the subscribe button, that really helps. Uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you later.